We're so glad that you're here. The bulletin you received this morning has great information about what's happening here at FBCC. Be sure to read through it. And while you're at it, please fill out the connection card and leave it with the ushers at the back at the end of service. We want to know how we can better serve you and pray for you. The connection cards help us to do so. If you're a first time guest, we are excited that you're here. We have a gift for you at the Connection Center, which is located at the back of the sanctuary. So make sure to take your filled out connection card back there after service. Parents, your kids are welcome to stay with you during service. But if for whatever reason you need to leave and attend to your kids, we have a cry room available in the children's building where the service is being live streamed. Now, here are some things going on at FBCC. There are a lot of ways to experience the Christmas season with our church family this month. On December 15th at 6 p.m. in the worship center, we have carols by candlelight. This is a fun night of worship as we gather to sing songs of adoration to our King. Next up, we have our annual Christmas party. A very merry Christmas party. Make sure to come check it out here at the church on December 20th at 6 p.m. Warm drinks, yummy snacks, crafts and activities, something for everyone to enjoy. If that's not enough fun, Sunday the 22nd is the day to show off either your ugliest or best Christmas sweater at our family services. But of course, all this fun leads to the big day of celebration and the reason for the season. Join us at our Christmas Eve service on, you guessed it, Christmas Eve, which will begin at 6 p.m. Don't hesitate to invite your friends and family to any of these events. Hi, my name is Scott Belfi, and I'm, I'm a part of Our Dog Ministry, which we go out and feed the homeless once a month. And I'm here to tell you about our big run that we do every year, our Christmas run. We serve not only hot dogs, usually, but we're doing smoked sausages this year. And along with that, we're doing Christmas stockings. And our goal is for 300 Christmas stockings. And we're filling them up with gloves, socks, beanies, candy canes, and the church is even making homemade cookies for them. So I just want to tell you that the run is coming up on the 21st of December. We're starting at 10 o'clock. Uh, I would love for you to come join and just even if you could just come in and help us bag everything up. I'll have more information for you out in the breezeway. I'll be out there. Come find a hot dog soup, but you know, um, I'll be the one behind the table. And just remember, if you can't make it out this month, we do this every month. So come in and be the hands and feet of Jesus. I've been homeless for many years, living on the streets due to drugs and alcohol. And, and I know that Jesus turned my life around, so I know there's hope. And that's what we do. We go up there and bring love and hope to the homeless, one hot dog at a time.